come to Papa. Is that shit? Am I making you wet? <gasps> Sorry. Am I making you wet? No, no, bone dry. Thanks for asking, though. Come on. Right. Hey, unhand me, sir. I just want to speak to Celeste. Listen, Menudo. You think you're the first money-grubbing gigolo to throw himself at my boss? Maybe not the first, but I'm hoping to be the last. No. Not while I'm working for her. She's been through too much, emotionally and surgically, to put up with this. You can't keep me away. No, I can't. No, you I can't. can't. I can't keep, no, no, very no, easily keep no, you away. No, you can't. I, I no, just did. No. Oh, yes, you did. So unless you have a written invitation to her home, you're not going anywhere near her. Hey, there's your clown suit. All right, and here's your car. Two. I don't speak Spanish. Hey, bro, did you make your move? I sort of made a move. Can you talk? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Millicent's just taking a post-coital cool off. Tell me you closed her. Tell me you closed her during the silent auction. She didn't even see me. I'm not sure about this one. It's just impossible to get to. I have no in. <laughs> or maybe I do. Sounds like you have an idea, but, but I can't tell because I can't see your face. Describe your face. My face? Yeah, what's it look like? Uh, thoughtful, very handsome, with a hint of mischief. That's the spirit. Hey, I'm there for you, whatever you need. Unless it's money, because then I can't do it, because I'm on an allowance. Great, great, okay. Listen, find out whatever you can about Celeste. Interest, passions, hobbies. When I'm invited to her home, I plan on sealing the deal. I will ask around the club. Thanks. And I've got work to do on my end. Hey, hey, my eyes are up here. Get in. Usually we just come here on Sundays because mom says it's too much sugar to have more than once a week. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Anyway, so Hugo, I want to talk to you about Arden. Listen. Throw your low, look out. That's right. You got Gotta to let, let your fantasies out, out for a bite. Say your name. Hugo. Ain't no shame. Do they make you sing that every time? I get to sing that every time. Okay. You know, if you guess the weight of your yogurt, it's on the house. Five pounds. That's so off. I'll give you one more guess. 30 pounds. Let's check. <laughs> wow, they're 14 ounces. Oh, I was so close. That'll be 650. Watch and learn. Oh, I like your bandages. Oh, I, um... I have a lot of rescue cats. Really? Yeah, so I'm no stranger to scratches. I'm always bleeding. Oh. <laughs> oh, thank you, uh... Cindy. Wow, Cindy. What an enchanting name. Oh, thank you. If these frozen yogurts are half as sweet as you, we're in for quite a treat. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you said 14 ounces, right? Gracias, sweet Cindy. I hope your pussycats realize what a beautiful scratching pose they have in you. Bye. I am a beautiful scratching post. See what I did there, hmm? You got us Froyo for free? No, my skills of seduction got us Froyo for free. Hmm. What if I told you I can teach you how to use your skills of seduction to get what you want? Ah, I forgot to ask for gummy bear.